issue of music. The issue of music, although I've read a number of places on the internet, tended that it is not a contentious issue. Indeed, it is a very contentious issue amongst the scholars. I refer my brothers and sisters to the Encyclopedia of Fiqh produced by the government of Kuwait, which now has reached over 60, I believe, or 70 volumes. Under the chapter on music, you'll find 24 issues surrounding music itself, a very long discussion. And they begin that discussion by saying, first and foremost, that there were scholars who considered music absolutely forbidden. There were those scholars who considered music permissible. There were those scholars who differed on the permissibility of music based on how much someone listen, listens to music. Thus, dear brothers and sisters, this is indeed a contentious issue amongst the scholars. Perhaps somebody is saying it's better to avoid the contentious issues. We can respect that if somebody does not want to involve themselves in such a project because they want to stay away from contentious issues, there's no problem. But there is a principle in usul that says you should not make inkar or forbid others who participate in such actions with your hands. Meaning you should not implement your opinion, your scholarly opinion that you follow on those who engage in another scholarly opinion. That being said, an issue of maturity and discourse in the United States, particularly for us, is that we need to reach the people. My first sheikh, my first teacher was Chuck D and Rakim and KRS-1. It was through music that I was guided to Islam. There are a large number of people out there who are waiting to hear the message of Islam. We have to reach them. Sheikh Uthman Dan Fodio used mood music to spread Islam. Islam was spread in Pakistan and India, primarily through the usage of music. 